January eighth, does my sacrifice live? And Abraham built an altar and bound Isaac his son. Genesis twenty two verse nine. This incident is a picture of the blunder we make in thinking that the final thing God wants of us is the sacrifice of death. What God wants is the sacrifice through death, which enables us to do what Jesus did: sacrifice our lives. Not, I am willing to go to death with thee, but I am willing to be identified with thy death, so that I may sacrifice my life to God. We seem to think that God wants us to give up things. God purified Abraham from this blunder, and the same discipline goes on in our own lives. God nowhere tells us to give up things for the sake of giving them up. He tells us to give them up for the sake of the only thing worth having: life with Himself. It is a question of loosening the bands that hinder the life, and immediately those bands are loosened by identification with the death of Jesus. We enter into a relationship with God, whereby we can sacrifice our lives to Him. It is of no value to God to give Him your life for death. He wants you to be a living sacrifice to let Him have all your powers that have been saved and sanctified through Jesus. That is the thing that is acceptable to God.